Hello everybody, once again this is Gonzalo Vasquez, your Spanish teacher, and this is the easiest way to learn Spanish with NLS, the Natural Learning System. So let's do it. In this video we're going to talk about the letter P or la letra P in Spanish. So the name of the letter is P. In English is P, and in Spanish is P, and the sound is exactly really close to the the one. It's exactly the same as in English. The thing is, in English, sometimes change. If you put the H in front, it's going to get. In in in, in Spanish, never change. The sound of the letters stay the same. So uh, the sound of the letter P, el sonido de la letra P es ¿sí? with the leaves pa with the a pa 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 es el father pa 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 See the difference between this one and this one? This one is papa, has the tilde in la, papa. That says the father. And the one that has no tilde, you know, see no tilde, so it's papa. This is potato, potato. Okay? Pato. Paso. Pato is a dog. Paso is like a step. Palo. Stick. Pasta. It's, yeah, everybody knows what pasta is. The same pasta in, in, in English. Pasta. Okay. So we have pa, papa, papa, pato, paso, palo, pasta. Once again, remember the difference between papa and papa. Okay. Now, um, con la letra E, la P con la letra E will be P, P, peso, it's way, way, no heavy way, peso, pesado, perla, everyone know the pearls, pera, it's a pear, you know the, the, the fruit, Perro. It's a dog. Pena. Pena is when the person is too shy and I feel like he, you know, say something and then, ooh, I don't want it. You know, peste. Peste is something, this is some kind of disease, you know, something that, yeah, like peste, disease is like a, the weeds that we have in, in, in the grass is a, is, is, is a pest. Pest, a pest. Okay? Basically the same. So we have pe, peso, perla, pera, perro, pena, peste. Now if you remember back to the R over here, la R y la R. That I explained to you before, you see here how we use no perla, perla. Here is following a, a, a vowel, you know, is following the R, so it's pera, it's fruit. And here we have double the R, so it's double sound, perro, perro. Okay? Going back to the exercise, remember, run, 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 perro. Okay, that's going back to the class of the R or the R. La P con la I, P. Piña. Here we have the Ñ also. See, between piña, it's a pineapple. Pinta. 
tinta es a measurement, you know, es a, es a, a liquid measurement, and also in some countries uh, they use it as a, like a, you know, a, a, a handsome man or a person, you know, just uh, dressed very well and looks good, so they, oh, estás pinta. But that's an uh, idiomatic expression, making making a reference that the person uh, looks good. Pintura. That's a paint. Pintura. Pintor. It's a painter guy. Pinza. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a long nose players. Pinza. Also is well known as a pinza. Is the that the kind of the 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 the, the clippers or no clippers on that they they put away the, the ladies put in the in the hair to hold it in place. Pinza. Okay. Pincel. Pincel is the really, really, it's pencil, pencil everywhere. I don't know what pencil is. You know, the, the, the really thin uh, uh, brush that they used to paint. Okay, so we have P, piña, pinta, pintura, pintor, pinza, pincel. Con la letra O will be po. Pollo. It's a chicken. Polo, North Pole, South Pole, Pozo, it's a well, Pozo, well, well water, uh, Potro, Potro is a, is a, a horse, a young horse, Potro, Postre, a dessert, Poste, it's a post, telephone post, light post, okay? Once again, P con la O, Po, Pollo. You go to hear some people and they say, they say Pollo. Some people go to say Pollo. It's Pollo. Polo, Pozo, Potro, Postre, Poste. Okay. Con la U will be pu. Punta. It's the tip. Front tip. Punta. The tip of my shoes. You know, la punta de mi zapato. Pulla. Pulla. It's something, it's also like a tip, really, really sharp tip than, than it, 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 you. You put it on your body, you know, you feel like it's scratching you. Pulga. Pulga. It's a flea. Those fleas, dan, dan, you know, those fleas, dan, dan, dan. It's, it's popular in the dogs, you know, it's a kind of the, the animals that go with the dogs and everything. Pulgar. Pulgar is an. Pulgar. Is the 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 dumb, the you know, this is the pulgar pulgar this pulgar pulido pulido is a is a sharp uh, a person uh, you know look sharp or look smooth or, or, or also uh, you can hear it as a, a a proper last name puro that's pure. Pure, same thing. Okay, so once again, pu, punta, pulla, pulga, pulgar, pulido, puro. So remember, this is the easiest way to learn Spanish with the natural learning system. Don't forget to subscribe. In my channel, you can go ahead and subscribe. Uh, you can contact me anyway if you want it. You can go ahead to my uh, webpage. Uh, or send me an email. If you want to visit my webpage, it will be right here, www.buenoletsdoit.com or email me at gonzalo at buenoletsdoit.com. Feel free, if you have any comment, 
I'm open to hear from you. I'm here for you, remember. I'm your Spanish teacher. Once again, thanks for watching. Have a blessed day.